Interdermal Medication Administration. We're going to walk through Interdermal Medication Administration. Right now, this technique is being used for the Janeos monkeypox and smallpox vaccine. The Janeos smallpox and monkeypox vaccine comes in a 0.5 milliliter vial that with careful withdrawal will yield five 0.1 milliliter intradermal doses. Important vaccine information is located on this vial, including the lot number and the manufacturer. Each of these vials, once accessed, is only good for eight hours and should be returned to the refrigerator. You will find the expiration date for this vaccine on the side of the box only. Remember, however, that despite the expiration date on the side of the box, each vial is only good for eight hours once accessed. Supplies for this procedure include gloves, tuberculin syringes, alcohol prep pads, and band-aids. We will be administering a 0.1 milliliter dose. The location of intradermal dose administration is two to three inches below the antecubital fossa. Skin must be held taut, which can be done from below by holding the skin or by holding the skin distal to the injection site. The injection site should be cleaned and allowed to dry prior to medication administration. While holding the skin taut, we will use a 5 to 15 degree angle with the bevel of the needle up and you will be inserting the needle bevel until it is just within the skin. Slowly insert the medication until you see a wheel, bleb, or blister-like formation and have injected the entire 0.1 ml dose. Once medication has been administered, we will withdraw the needle at the same angle that we used for insertion, nearly parallel to the skin. Wheels can look different on different skin tones and can be hard to see. If a wheel does not form, you will need to repeat the 0.1 milliliter dose at a different location or at least two to three inches away from the first location. Once the vaccine has been administered, avoid putting pressure on the site, but you can apply a Band-Aid.